Good evening, sir. Can I introduce you to appetizer while you wait? Uh, no, I'm good. She'll be here in a minute. Every time you don't pick up, I get blown. Is you at work? Did you make it home? Either way, I can reach you in this friend zone. Niggas chase me with the face in me. Ain't nothing with the fuck they do. Oh, look at you. In the cafe. Alone. Yeah, I am. Well, let's get something straight. Just in case my friend asks about this little meeting that we're having, just know I will let her know every little word that comes out of your mouth. So choose your words wisely. Understood. Mm, so what's up? I need to know why my wife is here. <laughs> I think that's something that you need to be asking her. Look, don't give me that fast talk with you broke psychology bullshit. Matter of fact, it's your program, ain't it? It is. But your name ain't on it. So my question for you is this. Why is my wife in this hellhole trying to fix something that she damn sure ain't ready for? And how do you know that she's not ready? We all have to grow up somewhere and move on. But it's our responsibility to make sure we return and try to help. I mean, look at you. Full ride to college. Sports was your way out, mm -hmm. but that wouldn't have happened if someone didn't fund the youth programs. I mean, it's full circle. We have to return something. I just don't feel this is the way. Not for damn sure I ain't sacrificing myself for these niggas out here. And you. I bet you got a trick up your sleeve, don't you? A trick up my sleeve? Your wife mentored me and several other women. Even when our own mothers couldn't see a way out, she did. Do you think I would betray her? Look, I don't trust politics. Politics is all game. And it's always the good people that get hurt. Now listen up. I'm a businessman. And I don't see nothing but loss in this. People can't win at this level. That's because mentally, people are not free. This is the only way we can help our people. Our people? Yes. <laughs> listen, I ain't even understanding all that Black Lives Matter stuff that you talking. Niggas are robbing steal from you in a heartbeat. You know that, right? There has to be a way that we can do something different than just talking. Matter of fact, what's up with them boarded up properties? Oh, so that's what you want to know about. Not how we can help, but how we can get paid. Hell yes. What you think that? Therapy gonna make people feel better? Yes. Or we can teach them how to put the houses that they stand in front of every day. Look, what you're saying makes sense. I agree with it. I don't want to make it seem like I don't love my people. But bottom line, money is power. Okay. Maybe there is something coming that's in line with your type of change. <laughs> but I wouldn't want to put you in a room full of wolves if you're not a wolf. <laughs> Understand? All the way. Oh, well, next time, office hours, bruh. I don't do business in the streets. Hmm. Understood. We've been trying to get the city to uh, tear down for years. I actually kind of like this old feel. I like, I'm fond of the old feel, feel of this building. So, I mean, what brings you here? I heard about your work. And um, my church does counseling also. 
do my past. Oh, okay. Okay, I may have to come visit one day. Love to have you. That's kind of why I'm here. You see, we've been through this with the city before. We're not crazy. These kids and adults, they need love. Not doctors trying to give them some drug. I see through the disguise. He was in a black woman to do that dirty work. So this isn't a session. I'm sorry, your name is? Mary. Okay. Well, uh, and you're here for what? To let you know that my church has got it handled. These kids out here are out of touch with God, not their minds. I won't disagree with you, Mary, but my approach is more research-based and we follow behavior. Okay, but where is the love? Hmm? You sit way back there, like you scared to touch people. Do you know how powerful a hug is? Or telling someone that they're loved? You don't, do you? I know. Let me guess. They just told you it's just science and just listening to people's problems. I agree. Therapy can be somewhat cold. But I have to protect myself, too. I can't get too attached. Or I may not be as effective. That's because you're afraid of the power of love. It'll make you try harder than you want to. You ain't committed. The people from my church have lived here all their lives. We've seen people come and go. I have given up a lot to be here. I want to be a part of the change. And actually, I'm not against trying harder. You should meet my pastor. He's ambitious and full of hope, just like you. So what can I do beyond this office to help? There are community events you can help support, fundraising. There are a lot of ways. Listen, I hope this didn't discourage you from continuing your work. I'm just tired of people thinking that we need therapy. Where is the love? Well, Mary, we have methods that are less chaotic now. Love as a whole is, I mean, it's, it's complicated. Well, how do you think God changes things? Love is complicated. And it's attached to everything, including hate. It's a circle. You're married, right? Yes, I am. That man couldn't be hated by anyone more than you. You wanna know why? <laughs> why? Because no one can hurt you more than the ones you love. Look at these kids. Their friends hurt them, then they turn their enemies overnight. And then they get to shooting at one another. We have to show them. It's a circle. You can forgive and return to love. People still have conditions that affect behavior. Trauma at a young age it can't be erased with a hug. How do you know? Have you tried it? Can I tell you a story? All right, we got time. My grandson, he is a headache. His mama passed when he was little. His father been in and out of jail. So I knew I had to work on him. Wait in the water. Wait in the water, children. Wait in the water.
Gaza. Yes, I'll accept the charge. Grandma, it's me. Grandma, I swear, I ain't do nothing. Then why are you locked up? Tyrell, what's going on? I need bail money, Grandma. I'll explain everything when I get out. Oh, when you get out? Boy, I live check to check. Grandma ain't got it. I don't know what to do. I don't know what I want to do, Grandma. I ain't do nothing. I swear. Okay, okay. I call the pastor and, and see if we can use the church's kitchen to sell dinners or something. I'm gonna get you out, baby. Thank you, Grandma. I love you. I love you too, baby. See, that boy ain't no troublemaker. Now, he do a lot of dumb stuff, but nothing like that. I know that knucklehead friend of his has something to do with it. Who's his friend? Some boy named Brian. Someone was hurt. Well, he said there was blood at the scene, but no body there. <laughs> Brian probably dumped it somewhere, if you ask me. Wow. Oh my God. So is he okay? Because that's a serious event for someone to go through. He was a nervous wreck after that. Wouldn't even leave the house after we got home from jail. Agoraphobia. That's the medical term for it. Look, Mary, I can go visit him if you want. No, that's, that's not needed. This is where love works its miracle. Now he's hurt because his friends didn't help not one bit. But I told him, your problems are your problems. Nobody owe you nothing. Well, maybe he could go, you know, tell the truth and let the police handle it. <laughs> Doctor, you sure got a lot to learn. The church raised $5,000 for his bail. We raised all that money to get you out. And all you do is stay in the house. Get your feet off my couch. Now, I know you don't want to stay around here with me all day. Maybe you okay? What's going on? Well, thank you very much. I think I'll I'll Everybody saying I snitched. Did everybody help with your bail? I wouldn't worry about them. It's not that easy, Grandma. They think you snitched. You're bad for y'all there. You think I don't know that? I wasn't born yesterday. And snitched. Snitched on who? You were the one who got caught with the gun? Yeah. Yeah, I got caught. And he said I got out too quick. And I shouldn't even have a bail. They need to mind their business. Long as you know what happened. What is your buddy saying? I ain't even talked to him. <laughs> That's a good thing. You need to keep your distance. I need to talk to someone. Yeah, God. Tell him what's on your heart, baby. Give it all to him. Give it to him. Well, when I was locked up, I started to think about my father. 
So I did some reading. I think he was bipolar. By what? <laughs> Don't make excuses for other people's actions. Now he might have been off a little, but that still don't give him an excuse to act a fool. There's this therapist in town and she's giving free sessions. I was thinking about, about going over there and- No, nah, baby, we don't do that. When you were in school, they tried to put you on drugs when you were young. That's all they know how to do is put people on drugs. Just drug them up. But what if they're right? What if I need it? Grandma, sometimes, sometimes I get, I get low. And I don't think I can bounce back that easy. Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd. When I'm struggling, I read that. You see, he needed someone to care at that moment, not a diagnosis. I care. Although this is not a drug rehab program, this is serious business to me. And Mary, it appears to me that your grandson needs my help. Oh, looks like I've taken up enough of your time today. No, wait. <laughs> yes. I you don't have to worry about him. He's back in the church and away from them fools in the streets. Mary, I still want to help in any way I can. Well, come on by the church and meet my pastor. I got a question for you. Sure. After you've poured into all these people, who's going to pour into you? God will. I used to be in the back seat. Now I multiply these haters, try to subtract me You don't want a problem, then you don't want to get that me Tax these niggas, I like counting figures I'm too busy trying to get it, I ain't posting pictures Yeah, my skin like butter and it tastes like honeydew All you gotta do is say the word and I'm coming I, I cannot lie Hey, thank you So what's good, girl? Not much, really So what's been going on? You still working? Not right now Girl, Rona done fucked up all my money Right Everybody going through it. But I told you about that job shit. Yeah, I know. I'm just not trying to run around getting caught up. I feel you. Yo, Sean and Lex got locked up. When that happened, all the money was gone. Damn. Mm hmm No credit cards? Nothing? So I tried working with this other guy that he was getting credit card numbers from, from a few spots out of state. But as soon as Rona hit, all the stores closed. Hold up. Because I already know what you're getting at, girl. I'm going to say no now. Look, I'm sorry, but my scamming days are over. I'm not putting my life on the line. That's fair time, and I ain't doing it, okay? No. I know. Mm -hmm. All right, I know. But I wonder if you're still trying to get money, though. I mean, I'm always trying to get some money. But I ain't doing nothing crazy, though. No, it is easy money, trust me. How easy? <laughs> Look, so my brother was all messed up when his boy got locked up. Something happened at that trap house. I don't know. <laughs> but he was all worried. I ain't never seen him like this. Damn, for real? Yeah. What you think happened? No, and them two probably something stupid. <laughs> sure. <laughs> he was all like, yo. I gotta go see somebody about, about something. I'm like, nigga, don't nobody care about that street shit. <laughs> then he was talking about something, no. It's this new therapy office and it's free. Hold up, I'm confused now. So your brother's going to therapy 
What does that mean? What you think? Them good drugs. <laughs> what do you think I got all them pricks from before? Girl, you know I don't ask too many questions. <laughs> I had about five people that was getting perks. And you know that ain't a lot. But right now, with the way that everything been, we could get a lot more. Okay. But you know therapists don't prescribe perks, right? No, but they have other drugs. Listen, all we have to do is find the right issues to get to the right drugs. Come on now, a lot of them get these kickback drugs anyway. All right, I'm gonna let you handle that though. Mm -hmm. But what if they don't give the drugs there? Behind every doctor, there's a drug dealer. That's probably how they got here. So, what happened when your brother went? I don't know, that nigga probably went there for nothing, I think. <laughs> so look. I'm gonna let you know more about it later, all right? All right. To this money. To the money. Yeah. <laughs> Things I don't care what it costs me. Pour up, let me dry the boat. Lick it like an envelope. You been bragging about the stroke. Pull up and put on the show. Uh, I'm a call. Bitch, you know I been wrong. He licked the kitty, but I walk him like a big dog. You know how I like it. Pick me up like a cabbie. Whisper in my ear from the back while you grab. Gonna look good. Gonna smoke good. Hey, Ree. What's good, baby? How you been? Mm, uh uh. No. Don't do no, hey, Ree, Ree, how you been? Where you been? Chill, look. Shit crazy out here. I need to let go. Man, you heard about what happened with my brother and Ty, right? Who the fuck Ty? Boy, don't play dumb. You know about him. So why you ain't call me? Look, like I said before, a nigga trying to lay low. All right. Lay low. Lay low with who, though? You trying to help me tonight. I ain't trying to go, I ain't with this back and forth shit. Whatever. So, you got the perks? I might. You playing. This shit is real serious right now. Okay, then no, I don't. Nobody does right now. And what happened to all them pills that you had anyway? Long fucking story. Okay, does it start with where you been? Because I'm listening. Where's the money? 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 Last time I did that, I ain't seen your ass in weeks. So now we want to crawl out of a hole broke? Something went down, all right? Niggas got robbed, I owe niggas money. That ain't a good combination. Niggas want me dead. Ree, you gonna help me or what? Look, so I'm gonna help you out, all right? But just know you're gonna have to help me out too. Look, I got you. Anything you need me to do, I'm there, all right? When all this blows over, I got you. And don't slam my door. Nigga. Hey, oh. I get my word from the narco. We outside, could've died. Maya Angelou, still I rise. We don't hide, greasy guys. We got fries, super size. I'm a big man. I talk big racks, I need big stacks, ain't no chit chat How you hate on another mind, I don't get that That's something I don't understand, I ain't with that Ay. Trap house, trap house, banging again I'm in this bitch slanging again, bringing them in But we're stuck in the drug and I guess I done made him a man Made me a plan, I knew I was 
that's the way before I made me a friend I'ma do what I can But you got no respect, you gon' use and abuse me That's how I know you ain't my man But it's my fault, I put too much trust in a nigga But they ain't gon' get it to show I'm a winner My fuck around and had to bust me a nigga But luckily nigga, I got God to cover me nigga The baddest bitch just to come for me nigga This money got me living comfortably nigga You know that I'm with it, I'm back now My CD on my back now I got shit I could get through the pad down Had to pick up the mic, put the crack down We talking facts now I like they shawty boy, and the knock goes hard, me get my 